Well, a new structure on sacred ground could raise a royal ruckus. Catherine Cruz takes a look at a request for a new tomb at a cemetery reserved for Hawaiian royalty. It's a KITV4 News exclusive. It is a final resting place for royalty, Mauna Ala, the mausoleum for Hawaiian kings, queens, their family, and trusted advisors. Now the state land board is being asked to allow Abigail Kamananakoa to be buried there. The royal order of Kamehameha sees no problem. We believe that it's, uh, it's very pono and it's proper. Kavana Nakoa would like to be buried here at the Makai corner of the cemetery. It is directly across from the Wiley tomb and would look just like it. The footprint, however, would be slightly smaller at 15 by 15 feet. This vault, named for Robert Wiley, who served as foreign minister, houses nine members of Queen Emma's family. For those who acknowledge her lineage, it is a request for Kavana Nakoa to be with family. This piece of property is relegated to the chiefs of all of her ancestors. And Princess Abigail is a descendant, and therefore she has her kuleana and a right to be, we believe, to be buried here. She is the adopted granddaughter of Prince she David Kavana Nakoa. Sousa doesn't believe there'll be a royal fuss among Native Hawaiian organizations about the new tomb, the cost of which will be paid for by the princess. We owe them a lot, and they have put things together and they have restored many of our treasures, and we are very grateful for that. And as a royal order of Kamehameha, we believe very strongly in the continuance of our tradition. The Association of Native Hawaiian Civic Clubs voted unanimously this weekend not to oppose the plan. The Office of Hawaiian Affairs is still researching the issue and has yet to take a position. But some believe pushback may come from individuals who don't recognize Kavana Nakoa as a Hawaiian princess. The state land board makes its decision on Friday. Catherine Cruz, KITV4 News. The last person to be buried at Mauna Ala was Kavananakoa's brother through adoption. That was David. In 1953, he was laid to rest in the Kalakaua crypt. Mm, great exclusive story there. Interesting one, huh?